forecast. Michelle joining us now with more on what should be a pretty nice day today, but some changes on the way. Yeah, not bad for today, Patrick. We're still storm free, but we are watching a coastal storm that will develop and slowly move past our area. Uh, Wednesday into Friday. Let's go ahead and start off though this morning with a hello to some new friends at the Baldwin Elementary School. But talk I was out there yesterday as a mystery reader to Mrs. Treichler's first great class. It was a lot of fun to be out there. Read one of my favorite books, Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. And a great group of kids, so thank you for the invitation to come out there. As we uh, take a look over our area this morning on live pinpoint Doppler 12, and we'll start with our city cam. We are dry across Rhode Island and southeastern Massachusetts where the temperatures are coming in around uh, 32 degrees right now. Wind chill, 24 northwest winds at 10 miles an hour. So here's radar dry and quiet across Rhode Island and southeast Eastern Massachusetts as we uh, take a look at the bigger picture here. We'll widen out the view and show you where the snow is starting to arrive in Chicago. We just saw those live pictures. So the center of the storm system will start to shift to the east and then move off of the Virginia, North Carolina coastline. And from there, track a little bit closer to us from what we were thinking yesterday morning means more of an impact around here with both rain and wind, as well as maybe some snow in the forecast. So it's a large coastal storm. Starts Wednesday by the afternoon hours, the height of its late Wednesday night into Thursday night. Windy with rain, snow and sleet and we'll be watching not only for potential coastal flooding, but if we get some heavy rain around here, our local rivers and streams will need to be monitored too. About 32 degrees in Providence, Newport's at 32, westerly around 31. Future cast for the rest of the afternoon. High temperatures today around 44, a mixture of clouds and sunshine tonight down to about 33. It's going to be a mostly cloudy night, but we shouldn't see much in the way of rain or snow. As we head into your Wednesday, we'll start to see that light rain and snow developing. The winds will be picking up too, and you can see that northeast direction about 15 to 25 miles per hour with some higher gusts. And again, the strongest winds will be late Wednesday night through the day on Thursday. So pretty messy uh, forecast here in storm system, one that will be impacting mid-Atlantic Wednesday. Thursday travel up through New England. So it's a slow moving storm. We'll be tracking well off to our south and east. This is just one computer model's take this morning on where some of the highest snowfall accumulations will be. And don't pay as much attention to the amount of snow that this is forecasting, but where you see these deeper purples and reds, you can see inland areas have a higher chance of accumulating snow than closer to the coastline. Closer to the coast, we're thinking mostly rain and sleet, and that's exactly what our future cast shows. So this is taking us through Wednesday, 4 o'clock in the afternoon Wednesday, starting to see some rain to the south, snow up to the north and west. And that rain snow line may set up somewhere across Rhode Island and southeastern Massachusetts, certainly further north that you go, the better the chance of seeing some heavy wet snowfall accumulations and combined with the winds, could be looking at some power outages where we do see snowfall accumulations. Notice mostly green, especially south and east of Providence. So here's that seven day future cast. Stormy Wednesday, Thursday as well. We're still talking about the potential for some high tides to bring some minor coastal flooding. We'll be watching beach erosion. It's going to be an extended period of strong winds and rough surf. Gusts 50 to 60 miles per hour. Friday still maybe unsettled with snow showers in the morning, but looking like it'll clear out in time for the upcoming weekend.